Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Sex Tech. Today in the studio, I'm going to show you how to live stream on your PlayStation 5. And this is actually really easy to do. But first, you need to link your YouTube account or your Twitch account. So we need to go back to the home screen here and then go up to the top and go to settings. And then scroll on down to users and accounts. And then we want to go to link services. And then go to Twitch or YouTube. And then you need to sign in with your email address and passwords, and this will link it to your PlayStation. And then you need to allow it and accept the permission. So I have this linked already right here. You can see it's linked. Once we have that associated with our PS5 account, we can go back to the game now. And this becomes really easy to do. So I'm just in Minecraft, and I'm going to hold down the share button right here. And I want to open up this screen where I can go on over to broadcast now and select this. And then I can go to the three little dots and I can choose the service. So I can go to change service and I can decide if I want to stream to Twitch or YouTube. So I'm going to choose YouTube for this example right here and select this. And then I can go to the title, I can go to the description, the tags, and the privacy right here. So if you want to make it public so everyone can see it. Otherwise, if you are doing this for the first time, go to unlisted right here and then you can just practice live streaming and get everything set up the way you want before it actually goes public and then you have private right here so once you actually get everything uh, the way you set up and you you want you can go to public and then people can start watching you there but we do have more broadcast options right here and then we can include the camera we can include the chat the display activity the overlay position so I have this set up to bottom right I believe that's the camera. And then we can include the party audio right here. And then we have video quality. So if you have really good internet, go to 1080p at 60. If it's not very good, I'd say probably drop it down to 720p at 60 frames per second. Otherwise, you have the lowest right here as an option. So good internet, go to the top option. Bad internet, go to the medium options right here or very low. So you'll probably notice sometimes the stream will cut off if it's um, way too high for you right here. So you can just adjust that. Now to allow your friends to be actually like in your live streams, they need to do one thing. They need to go to the game base right here and then go to the party chat settings and just open up a party chat and have your friends do this if you want to hear their voice in your live streams. Just go to voice chat settings and then go to where it says share your voice. Select allow to include your voice in other players' broadcasts and view clips. So your friends need to do this. Otherwise, uh, when they talk, you won't hear them in the live stream. So it'll be very easy now to include it. Then let's go back over to broadcasts. So I got everything set up the way I want. It's unlisted. Now I'm going to go live right here and select this. You're currently in a party. Do you want to include the audio? So we can go to yes. And the broadcast has now started. So I'm not actually live streaming to people. This is just unlisted. But you can see my camera position. I can adjust it accordingly and decide where I want it. So let's put it in the bottom right here. And that's actually very large. You may not like it very large if you have the camera, but you can adjust it later on as well. So you can press this now and you can go to broadcast and you can see if someone is watching. It should say viewers and it should pop up. Any kind of like chat or anything should pop up over here. But we can select this now and we have the option to mute the microphone. We can go to the camera options. We can turn off the camera. We can move the camera display left and right. And then we do have the overlay position. We can display the chat, display activity, and then we can decide the position. So typically the chat will be over here, but we can lower it over here, depending on what kind of graphics are on the screen. Sometimes like you might have over here to the left and there's a bunch of stats and stuff um, for the game and you don't want it sitting over that. So we can go to that position there and then we can pause the broadcast or we can completely stop it right here. Then we do have the option for additional settings for our live streams. If we go back to the home screen, and I don't think this will allow us. There we go. Let's go back to the home screen right here and then go up to settings and it says video is paused, broadcast only microphone. So when you go back to the home screen, this screen will not be displayed. It will only display the game. So all this is hidden from the people watching only the audio from the microphone is being picked up. So just go to settings now and then go to captures and broadcasts and then go to broadcast and then we will have additional settings for our live stream on here like the video quality, the audio, we can include the party audio right here. We can go to the camera settings and this is probably what you want to go to 
Uh, you can include a green screen under here as well. You can change the size for medium, small, or large. So I can go to medium so it's not so large because it took up so much of the screen. Uh, I can go to clip masking and I can go to chroma key and watch this. I have a green screen I'll put up in the background. And when I put up a green screen like this, you can see it's cutting out the background image. So anywhere where this green screen is, it's going to cut out the like the gameplay. So I'll see like the gameplay right there and it'll cut out the entire background. So that is very cool to have. I would set up a green screen and then you can just level right here. You can flip the horizontal. You can add effects to this if you want to like make it look like a comic book. You can make it brighter, the contrast, uh, the transparency. You can refocus on your face. So if you want to zoom in on your face only, press this and it will kind of like crop it a little bit. Then you can restore the default settings and go to OK. And then turn on this again and then redo all your settings. And then we can go back to the game and it should be just like normal now and we're live streaming set the uh, the camera option over here and then you should be good to go just make sure you end your broadcast at some point it looks like there's still nobody watching me but just go to stop and you should be good to go hopefully this video did indeed help you out if it did leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more tech up videos coming up next on your six tech